Good day, ladies and gentlemen, Pilot here, and welcome to a, well, a bit of a little review of a pretty cool utility that's just been, uh, it's been around for a very short period of time, and I actually saw this a few days ago when it was actually uh, posted on the minecraftforum.net site, and it is really cool. Basically, what it is, it is a 3D character skinning utility. So yeah, for all you... Uh, character skinners out there, this might be another really cool program you could use to actually help create your skins. So yeah, as I said, it's on the minecraftforum.net site. Um, I was just, as I was just on the end, but if you want to find it on that front page of that site, you just scroll down a little bit. Doo -doo 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 -doo. And as I was looking at it before, there it is. So this is pretty cool. Uh, that's obviously just a screenshot of what it looks like. Um, as you can see, it's got a bit of a description off here. It's designed by Apparel. And there's also a link here. We'll just click on it. So we can go check it out. So this will, because this link will take you directly to the uh, to the thread. But I will provide a link in the description anyway. So yeah, now all you gotta do is you just uh, have a bit of a read, see what it's all about. You can see all the different. There's a few already videos already there that other people have already done. We'll just screen past that. Uh, it gives you an overview of what it can do um, and all that stuff. There's some obviously to do list of things he wants to add and fix and whatnot. Scroll down to the bottom near the bottom of his uh, post, and you'll see the downloads. There's obviously a couple of versions. Either people who want the RAR file or the zip, depending which one you want. Uh, to click on it, and bang, it'll just download it very easy. Very cool. Uh, so I'll close that. Now here it is on the desktop. All you got to do to actually uh, to install it is just right click. Well, this is all I did, and this is simply right click, uh, new folder. I'll just go MC. Skin 3D will do, that'll do. Oops, make that a three, <laughs> not a hash. It's cool of that. And then simply open up uh, the zip or the RAR file, whatever it is you've got. Just select them all and then just drag them into the folder you just created. And that's it, it's installed. You don't do any more, just open up the folder, which I've got in the wrong screen. And scroll down a little bit and you should see the exe file just there. Bang, open it up. And with a bit of luck, there we go. We have it right here. Sweet. How cool is this? Okay. So now, if this thing's actually going to start loading for me properly, maybe I shouldn't have gone full screen. <laughs> there we go. Um, sorry, this is my computer being a bit of a pain. But yeah, this is it. This is the, this is the uh, skin creator. So now, you can just use your... Uh, the right mouse button, if you hold it down, will actually zoom in and out. The left mouse button actually pans around. And you've got all these different options over here. That's obviously uh, the pencil here, or the, looks like a pencil, or paintbrush, whatever you want to call it. And you can draw on it. Ding, 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 ding. Scribble. And actually, if you go on the arms and the legs, you'll see it duplicates. I'll go back onto the eye there, and I'll zoom in a little bit. I'll go back onto the pencil there to actually draw. You can see it's duplicating the white dot. Because it just does that anyway. I think it's the way the uh, models are actually designed. The, the arms and the legs duplicate. The actual body and the head do not. So he's got to be a little bit wary of that. So it just mirrors. I, was, I said duplicates before. I should have said mirrors. But anyway. So yeah. Um, you got the... That's obviously the vision there. To uh, pan around and whatnot. Got the uh, pencil to draw. You got an eyedropper. So if you want to select a specific colour. You know, you can click on that to... Uh, then uh, paste. <laughs> that's kind of neat. Um, that's, I assume he's and that's like an eraser. I assume. Uh, where's the options? Skins. I'll have a look at them in a second anyway. Um, that's like the blend. Uh, sorry, the clone. I believe it is. So yeah, that's cloning. You got the camera view and. This is now, actually, if you want to draw it in the... Uh, I'll see if I can make that big screen. I can. So, yeah, so if you want to actually make it, do the actual drawing in the 2D version, which you might find a little bit easier, because it obviously lists what each individual part is, and you might prefer to do it this way. But, yeah, this is how you can do it. That's all that button up there does, which looks like a little picture. And if I can get out of that one, because that's obviously gets in the 3D, and that's obviously the 2D. And that would probably take a screenshot. And obviously you've got your undo button there if you want to undo anything. And you've got your save and so forth. 
so yeah, and obviously if you go to file, obviously you can save. Um, da, 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 where's the skins? You can import your skin. I want to see what I can find. There we go. There's my character there. There it is. <laughs> I just draw myself. Yeah. <laughs> Um, the other thing too is also, normally with my character, I've got uh, some headphones on or headset. Uh, that's actually not showing at the moment, but all you got to do is click on view and then go to, uh, whoops, do, 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 which visible parts, there it is, and you see helmet is actually unchecked by default. If you want to actually put that on, just check that and now I can actually pan around and there you go, I've got my headset on. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, and there's obviously then your colours down here, all the different colour selections. Whatever you want to choose, just click around there, you can select all them. So there, that's it ladies and gentlemen. I just thought I'd just throw this video out there, just for all you skin creators out there. Um, might be another little tool for you to use to uh, add to your little arsenal of uh, awesomeness, so you can actually create some, some wicked skins. Anyway, that's it. Um, that's the, uh, the MC Skins 3D app that you can download. So go check it out, the link will be in the description. So yeah, so, um, uh, what else should I say? That's about it. <laughs> so yeah, just leave likes, comments, and whatever else. Yeah, until next time, keep cool, keep safe, and I'll catch you around. Goodbye.